Okay, good day. My name is Apu Sunday from Car Structure Technology. In this class, I'm going to show you how you can install and manage your plugin on QGIS. Let's say there are some features that you want to do, there's a particular task you want to do, and then you need to install a particular plugin to to do your job. As you all know, uh, QGIS is uh, open source. So there are a lot of plugins there that you can help you do your job, do your particular uh, tasks based on your field, right? Okay, so for for you to install additional plugin, depend on the plugins you want to install, okay? So the, the approach is if you go to your plugin, we have a plugin here, and you make sure that your, your system is connected to the internet, right? Because you need to get the the additional plugins apart from the one that follow the uh, QGIS during your installations and if you want to get uh, other ones from the uh, internet so you, you have to connect your your system to the internet okay so now you click on plugin click on manage and install plugin Okay, so you see, you you wait for it. It's fetching the repository, so it's trying to connect to the internet. So you need to have your internet uh, network strong for it to be fast. Okay, so you see, we have different plugins here. Do you understand? We have uh, pl thousands of plugins here that you can install. So depend on the plugins that you want to install. Let's assume. Uh, based on the fact that we are dealing with CAD and GIS, uh, let's say I need uh, a particular uh, uh, plugin that can work as CAD in QGIS, right? So what I will do is that I will just write CAD. Do you understand? You know, based on the fact that you don't know the name, now you, you just write CAD. Do you understand? So now you see plugins that are related to CAD. We have AccuCAD, Cadastra, uh, CAD. G card uh, digitized card tools you understand you see many of them okay but the one i'm going to recommend is qad right you use qad it will it will work as an um, autocad in your in your QGIS, right okay so you click on qad and then you click on install So you wait for it to install. Okay, plugin install successful, right? So what you you see that this toggle uh, tick here right so now if you go to installed right you see that it fall into the installed plugin now for if you go to all you have uh, if you remove the card you now see all the plugins you have do you understand and then you see the ones here now you see the one that is installed right that is thick for example this one is installed geometric checker is installed but it's not thick that is to say it's not going to show in your QGIS, right? So anyone that I want to want it to show among the ones that I installed, that is showing this box already, that is showing the logo and the box, you can just check it, right? And you can off it and on it, right? If you check it like this, that is to say it will show in your in your QGIS, but if you uncheck it, that is to say it will not show in your QGIS. That is on, you don't need it at the moment, right? Okay. So this is how you install your plugin. If you go to uh, not installed that is the ones that you have not installed you understand there are many of them right okay so you closed your after a successful installation of your the particular plugin that you want to install you just closed right so you see you see we have the QAD here these are two so you see we have a uh, AutoCAD tools here we have a uh, offset we have a stand we have trim, you understand? We have line, 
you understand like the way AutoCAD chooses you can actually do your AutoCAD job here you understand the way you work in AutoCAD so this is how you can install your uh, plugins and manage your plugin on QGIS thank you very much and please subscribe to our channel like and share our videos so that other people can also benefit from this training thank you very much and have a blessed day